guys, it's Liz from Little Homestead on the Hill, and today we are going to be busy, 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 so stay tuned. I have a busy day. I feel like I always have a busy day. But I gotta make some homemade dog food, so I will show you guys how I make that. It's simple. I also going to be dehydrating some eggshells as I use that for the chickens, and I also use that for my gardens. And since it's springtime, I need to do a lot of it, so I always save my eggshells. And there's other things I gotta do today. I did get the pool open, which I'm very excited about. It's, uh, it's not green no more, it's blue. So you'll see that in the video as well. So just come along with me as I do my everyday life. Ugh, time to clean the oven. I hate doing this job, it sucks. Spray it hours ago with some easy off. So yeah, let's just see if it comes clean. It's disgusting. carpets by himself because they get super linty if you hang out close just a word of advice the last video I left you guys out the pool was green so we have been working on it yesterday and today I am gonna start skimming the top of it we're waiting for the water the water just finally reached over there so I can turn on the filter and then I'm just gonna scoop the top of it and tomorrow I should be able to start vacuuming it up I'm so excited I love it when I'm able to see blue and not green in my pool because it's such a huge difference so let's go switch the pump over i can take you anywhere somewhere we won't be scared you will see oh. Doggies! Hi! So I am gonna grab the skimmer basket and skim off the top of this.
now is I have a whole bunch of eggshells and I like using them in my garden and I like using them um, to give to the chickens and I have a very nasty bag of them. What I need to do is take all these eggshells and put them in here and dehydrate them for a while and I don't want to smell it. Because it will be stinky. And there we go. Simple, simple. I love my food hydrator. It's awesome. And like I said, I have all these eggs too that I'm making for dog food. And I'll actually add these shells to this when it's done. so far for my homemade dog food is I have three cups of rice and a package of mixed vegetables just like that and then I'm gonna cut up all 12 of these duck eggs and put that inside of it I'm just gonna add a can of sweet peas in it And give this a mix. So there's that mixed up. And the chicken is almost ready. It's still in the oven. So next thing I'm going to do is grab some coconut oil. And I am going to put in two spoonfuls of that in. I have their vitamins. This is Ultra Mega Superfood Complex Plus Joint. And what I do is I put four of these in there. Step is just to cut up these chicken breast into small pieces. Then what I do to make my life a lot simpler is I put them in gallon size Ziploc bags. So I do one meal for, I have four dogs, in one bag. So each scoop is one dog. So that's three, and that's four, and I just get the air out and seal it up. Give me love, give me all your love. Give me love, give me all your love, give me all your love. Well, leave some out. I'll put some out for the pug so I can show you guys how much she really does like it. And that's literally all she needs. Up getting one day, two days. Three days. That's how you make homemade dog food. It is so simple. Now let me show you how much my little girl loves it. Hey, got that? You want some? You good? What you could do is you could like supplement it. So you could give this to them for like breakfast or lunch, and then you could like give them the dry food for the rest of the time. But this is so good for them. I can't speak enough about it, especially for my Sharpay because she's had a lot of skin problems 
and I make this for her and it just it helps tremendously that coconut oil is so good for dogs it's good for humans so but the pug's eating her breakfast and I will catch back with you guys in a little bit that good Okay, let's check on our eggshells because usually what I do a lot is I will crunch them up if they're dry. See, they're getting dry. So what I like to do is just crunch them up. Just for big pieces. Okay, let's put the top on it and come back in an hour and check on the eggs. Uh, this is the second batch my camera died so i'm just gonna pulse these up like i did the other ones hello how'd you do i'm not broken i'm just split in two hope you're fine and got time to do everything oh, there we you go. said you Just pour those in. There we go. You have lots and lots of eggshells. So, like I said, these are great for your gardens. You can give them to your chickens. So, but I love having them around. I'm not broken, not broken, not broken. How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay. Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them. Well guys, we did a lot today. Like I said, we made our eggshells, we made dog food. You helped me with the laundry, you helped me get some chores done, clean my kitchen. And before this video gets to be an hour long, well, I'm just gonna leave it here. Well, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you guys in my next. Bye.